Okay. So that's my take profit. And wait. And I just have to wait till it hits the break even. And there you go. Okay. So it hit the break even and we can still even try to take another sell in the market because the software is still showing us that there will be another there might be another opportunity for taking another scalp so so this is the process you know so i'm going to pick another trade Set my take profit. Okay. Yeah. So, did you, is it 10 pips? Did you uh, put the. Yeah, we just. Oh, because of the spread. broken. Yeah, spread. That's so annoying. Yeah. Let me just oh. take the profit now. Yeah. So, yeah. So we've taken three scalp trades. We took this sell here. We hit break even here. And then we took a... Uh, uh, take profit here so yeah this one was a scalp this one was the when we we're talking about swing trades yeah. the first scalp the break even scalp and the third scalp trade all right so yeah uh any questions so far no sir all good thank you all right so you can just how was it so far for you what you saw i don't know have you seen it anywhere before no no i do understand some concepts uh from before that i've um studied but um it's very clear to be honest it's less headache i don't really like um indicators depending on them uh, i do like what you're doing from the price action stuff so um yeah i need to go over other videos that you've got in your channel and i think i'll be more clear okay so you don't need any indicators we've done scalping we even took a live scalp trade yeah. swing trade is not complicated everything and long term, short term, you know how to view the markets, you know how to use the indicator. Yeah. Yeah. The, the only thing I was um sort of um but you've cleared it up for me was the hedging part. I didn't really yeah. always understand it, but I now I see where to basically look into where to get out or get into. Um yeah. so that's clarified it for me. Thank you. And and the software also shows you where also. So we just have to work on um lot size allocation okay mm. even if it's for scalping for swinging for hedging uh i'll give you the formula now and you can always use this very simple formula 